So I put the car key in. Mm -hmm. And now we gotta freeze it. You have to go outside in the cold, right? I have to go to a cold area and stay there long enough to freeze the key. It's pretty much outside in the fucking... Where he said, yo, you gotta use C4 because it freezes. Right? Um... You don't have to go outside that far. You don't have to go that far. Is it where you shot Wolf? No. Really? Yeah. Where you fought Vulcan and Raven is literally a storage freezer. Oh. Yeah, I guess so. And yeah, let me guess, the hot spot is where uh, you you almost inst got insta killed. Yeah. Okay. You know, it sucks because it makes you backtrack all the way to Vulcan Raven. Freeze the key. Walk all the way back. Use the key. Walk all the way back. So where Vulcan Raven is, go up a little bit further because that's where it's hot, and then go all the way back and use the key. When you when you uh, when I do the twin snakes, it, it'll be way easier because in this room they decided to make it so everything is here. So if you wanted to chill the key, you go in the stupid frozen water. If you wanted to fucking heat the key, there's some pipes that you can shoot, and it. It has like hot steam. Yeah. I'm just saying. Kojima was smoking that good shit. <laughs> this is a freezer, right? Yes. Should be. Yeah, pretty much. So basically, you just look at the key. You notice that it's yellow. Just gotta wait. You have to wait? You gotta wait. I wonder if the items stay here or not. There, I see. What do you say? The, the keys were uh, autistic? Yes. <laughs> it's worse when it's like fucking... Like, I, the car key that I've been upgrading. Wait a minute. Wait a gosh darn minute. What? After this, you have to go up the L... <sighs> <laughs> they're, they're really... Tried to just fucking extend this game for no reason. Kojima needs his ass beat, bro. I wish his father beat him with the belt right now. How's that? What the fuck? That that's that's the sound of a battery trying to live, bro. Man, I thought that I was gonna get shot up into a fucking alien spaceship. <laughs> Damn, you just reminded me of something fuck. I've never heard that sound a day in my life. It sounded like the predator noise. That's okay, all I was that, fucking. That makes my brain slightly better now. <laughs> That's all I thought, yo, I'm dead, bro. <laughs> 
sometimes the horny is a curse. What, you looking for fucking extraterrestrial? No, this <laughs> extra is terrestrial? Extra terrestrial? No, this is picture. That, uh, where this girl was all like, hey, I didn't save my friend from fucking invasion just not to get probed. <laughs> Ice key. Success. Wait, where did these two morons go? Oh, it actually has to scan the card too? Oh. If only you could fucking put the key down on the ground, blow it up, and it's hot, right? What she would need is a fucking ass with the girl. This is gameplay in, in 1998, I guess. Imagine, I killed that guy, like twice. He's still here. Imagine walking through without the stealth suit. Just imagine walking through fucking this guy over here. And he shot you already. Yeah, like and again, twice. Up the ladder, down the ladder, down another ladder. No, I imagine before you even see him, he shot you. Nah, no one shoots first. It's always exclamation point first. This part is improved so hard, it's Twin Snakes. <laughs> But then again, that game was broken. Twin Snakes? Yeah. Wow. So it's just Metal Gear Solid 1 with Metal Gear Solid uh, fucking 2 mechanics. Which busted. You could just... I, I already told you how, like, bodies stay in Metal Gear Solid 2 enough. Yeah. And that's bad because people can catch it. Mm -hmm. Well, you know, you can just fucking trank everybody in there. The trank gun is from 2. And it's in this game, in Twin Six. You put that nigga to sleep, you put that nigga to sleep. These niggas are here for some reason. Ain't that about it, bitch. Why? I want you to work for it. They can work these nuts, bro. It's gameplay. They're, they're tired of, you know, not giving you gameplay. So you get to walk back and forth all day. You get to go up the ladder to go up the ladder. Up an elevator to go up an elevator. Gameplay. Look at the wait time. At this point, I imagine Konami did, didn't did do Kojima dirty. They just did him the way they thought he should be done. <laughs> I... That, that was strangely poetic. <laughs> Why? It's like a fucking poem, bro. Bro, this shit is torture, bro. Cause I'm at, I'm at, I'm at, she's a C4 right next to the car, and then you tell me it's just not hot. Okay, it's not hot. No one else can hear us, but go ahead. Sorry, but I didn't want the colonel to hear you. Okay, so what's up? I've got a good friend at the Pentagon. Yeah? He's the one who told me about it. It looks like the DIA recently developed a new type of assassination weapon. An assassination weapon? Snake. Have you ever heard of something called Fox Die? No. Fox Die. Liquid in the others were talking about it. Yeah. It's some kind of virus that, that targets specific people. I don't know all the details, but 
What are you trying to say? It is too similar. What is? The cause of death. Didn't the Arms Tech President and the DARPA Chief, I mean, Decoy Octopus, die of something that looked like a heart attack? Yeah. Well, apparently, Fox Die kills its victims by simulating a heart attack. No. You're telling me that Naomi was behind it? Snake, try to remember. Did Naomi give you some kind of injection? No, she. She was in the best position to have done it, but I don't know what her motive was. Does the Colonel know? I'm not sure. But he still hasn't questioned her. Colonel, what the fuck did she shoot me with? Myself. Colonel, what's new with the Naomi situation? I just placed Naomi under arrest. Arrest? She was sending coded messages towards the Alaskan base. I didn't want to believe it, but she must be working with a terrorist. Are you sure? I'm afraid so. She's being interrogated now. What kind of interrogation? Well, I'd like to avoid the real stuff. But we don't even have any sort of pentathol here. Call me if you find out anything. The fuck is... So it was true, is it? <laughs> I can't believe it. That means the Fox Dye vaccine must be around somewhere. Listen, I've got bigger things to worry about. But Snake, you might be infected too, you know. All I can do is leave it up to the Colonel. It can produce hypnosis? So it's like a true saying. I guess so. Whatever. I don't even know where I got Jamai Vu from. Oh, it's from. Nah, I know, I know now. What? Nah, cause um, there's this anime I'm watching right now. I think it's called Deep Blue. Wait, let me make sure if I'm right about that. But um, it's about this guy who uh. He goes back to like his uh I can't explain this. That was sounding retarded. No, it's not deep blue. Oh. I, I I'll tell you the name of it tomorrow when I get to it, but it's about this dude. He's traveling from like the city, so like I, I guess like Tokyo or something, yeah. back to like the countryside of Japan. And his friend died. And there's this thing called like a shadow, where it's like a copy of a person. It's like literally seeing another person. And um, they. I want to say it's like aliens right now, because I, I really don't know what it is, but it feels like aliens. Or something supernatural, or extraterrestrial. Not human. And, um, they're killing, like, uh... They're killing people on the island and taking their shape. So that's why they look like copies of people. Because, uh... They're just stealing people's, like... Images. Yeah. And the next episode, the episode that I think comes out either today or like for the week, is called Jamai Vu. Which is basically like that thing I explained to Devon where it's like the opposite of Deja Vu. Oh. I also explained Deja Jamai Vu wrong to Devon, so I feel retarded. Oh. But it's like, uh, so Deja Vu is like the feeling of having familiarity, even though you're not familiar with it. Whereas Jamai Vu is like, I know you, right? You know me, but I pretend I don't know you. Or like, I feel like I don't know you, even though I do. 
Oh, nice. Okay. So it's a feeling of unfamiliar. Yeah, even though you're familiar with something. Oh. Red Kiko, final. 90 with a distraction. <laughs> Ready for the long two elevators down. I mean, I should be back by the time I pull it. Yeah, alright. Fun fucking time. I'm definitely gonna fucking cut when fucking get the key, go get the key, use the key, nigga. Get the key, go use the key. Get the key, go use the key. Cause I'm getting so fucking tired. It's a waste of fucking time. destroys my brother and my only family. No. Great thoughts. We survived the hell together, Frank and I. He protected me. He's my one connection. The only connection I have to my past. And he came brought you back to America. No. I was in Mozambique when he came. Who was he? You mean Big Boss? Yes. He brought us to this land of freedom. This America. And then he and my brother went back to Africa to continue the war. And that's when it happened. You killed my benefactor and sent my brother home a cripple. I vowed revenge and joined Foxhound. I knew it was my best chance to meet you and I prayed for the day that I would. So, were your prayers answered? Yes. I waited two long years. To kill me? 
Is that what you care about? Yes. That's right. Two years. You were all I thought about for two long years. That's some kind of twisted obsession. You still hate me? Not exactly. I was partly wrong about you. What about Liquid and the others? <laughs> I'll have my revenge on them too. Naomi, you didn't kill that doctor too, did you? The one that used Gregory Fox for his genome experiments? Dr. Clark? No. That was to my brother. Afterwards, I covered it up and helped him hide out. So that ninja... I mean, Gray Fox... He's come here to kill me? I don't think so. I think he just came here to fight you. I wasn't sure before, but now I think I understand. A final battle with you. That's all he lives for. I'm sure of it. Boss. No. Naomi, tell me something. About Fox Dye. Fox Dye is a type of retrovirus that targets and kills only specific people. First, it infects the macrophages in the victim's body. Fox Dye contains smart enzymes created through protein engineering. They're programmed to respond to specific genetic patterns in the cells. Those enzymes recognize the target's DNA? Right. They respond by becoming active and using the macrophage as they begin creating TNF Epsilon. Huh? It's a type of cytokine, a peptide which causes cells to die. The TNF Epsilon is carried along the bloodstream to the heart, where they attach to the TNF receptors in the heart cells. And then, they cause a heart attack? The heart cells suffer a shock and undergo an extreme apoptosis. Then, the victim dies. Apoptosis? You mean the heart cells commit suicide? Naomi. What? You must have programmed that thing to kill me too, right? Do I still have time? Naomi. I don't blame you for wanting me dead, but I can't go yet. I still have a job to do. Listen, Snake. I'm not the one who made the decision to use Fox to die. Huh? You weren't? No. You were injected with Fox to die as part of this operation. I just wanted to let you know that. No, that's not the whole truth. Huh? The real thing I wanted to tell you was... Snake, I... Hey, what are you doing? <laughs> Naomi to make any more unauthorized transmissions. What? Naomi's been removed from this operation. What happened to Naomi? What did she mean when she said that Fox Dye was a part of this operation? Colonel, let me talk to her. I won't. She's under arrest. Colonel, you double-crossed me. Snake, there's no time for that. Right now, your job is to stop Metal Gear. Okay, Snake?
you. Yeah, but she said she wasn't the one who made the decision to use it. According to her, it was just one part of this operation. Hmm. If this goes all the way up to Campbell, it might not be so easy to get that vaccine. Oh well, forget about it. Nick nearly under arrest. What the hell is happening over there? What the colonel thinking? Campbell is... I'm sorry, I can't say anymore. But please believe me, I'm here to help you until the end. Master. Now the detonation code is completed. Nothing can stop Metal Gear now. Master, what's Wait, going on? Wait, you betrayed me? You found the key, and even activated the warhead for us too. I really must express my gratitude. Sorry to have involved you in that silly shipment and alloy business. What are you talking about? Wait, so you we back were able to learn the DARPA chief's code. Even with Mantis' psychic powers, he couldn't read his mind. Then Ocelot accidentally killed him during the interrogation. In other words, we weren't able to launch the nuclear device and we were all getting a little worried. Without the threat of a nuclear strike, our demands would never be met. What do you mean? Without the detonation codes, we had to find some other way. That's when we decided you might prove useful, Snake. What? First, I thought we might get the information from you, Snake. So I had Decoy Octopus disguise himself as the DARPA chief. Unfortunately, Octopus didn't survive the, the encounter, thanks to Fox Die. You mean you had this plan from the beginning? Just to get me to input the detonation code? Huh? <laughs> you didn't think you made it this far by yourself, did you? Who the hell are you? In any case, the launch preparations are complete. Once the world glitches the power of this weapon, I think Mandel is the most have no choice but to surrender the Fox Dime vaccine to me. There is the hole. It's useless now. He's in the hole. The Pentagon's plan to use you was already successful. So, what you missed was a total conversation with me and Naomi. Her brother was Gray Fox. And since I killed him in Metal Gear 2, she wanted to fucking kill him. I'll tell you everything you want to know. If you come around. Uh, during in the mission, she injected Fox Dye into me. But she did that. That's not because she was told to. Campbell, and she, she didn't stop because she fucking hates me. 
Master Miller's body was just discovered at his home. He's been dead for at least three days. I didn't know because my codec link with Master was cut off. But Maylene said his transmission signal was coming from inside the base. So who is it? That means that's liquid, bro. You've been talking to me, dear brother. Liquid. <laughs> Gonna pull out my trusty CO2 surviving mask over here. But yeah. Um. So basically, she was like a like a dirty little orphan that uh, Gray Fox saved and treated as like his little sister. And when Gray Fox, you know, followed Big Boss in Metal Gear 2. I killed them both, so <laughs> she didn't really like that. They're, they were literally her only family, and yeah, that sucks. Um, like, how do I get out of I'll find all of it. Snake, that's bulletproof glass. You can't break it with an ordinary weapon. Can you open the security lock here? I'll try. Just hold on for a minute. So, um, yeah. Fox Die is basically a retrovirus that targets specific people to kill them. So, she targeted everybody in Fox, uh, Fox Town. I hacked the security. Snake, I'm opening the door. <laughs> and I'm assuming the government decided to fucking target somebody like, um, the, the, the fucking president of the Darpa Chief. All oh, who that? Liquid! Liquid! <laughs> oh, put this on. Armor? Body armor. Anyway, Snake! Did you like my sunglasses? You point a weapon at your own brother? Why did you disguise yourself as master? So I could manipulate you more easily. And you performed quite well, I must say. Although the boys at the Pentagon are probably saying the same thing. What the hell are you talking about? Following orders blindly with no questions asked, you bust your warrior's pride and become nothing more than a palm snake. What? Stopping the nuclear launch, rescuing the hostages, it was all just a diversion. A diversion? The Pentagon only needed for you to come into contact with us. That's what killed the Armstead President and decoy Octopus. You don't mean... That's right. You were sent here to kill us so they could retrieve Metal Gear undamaged, along with the bodies of the Genome soldiers. From the beginning, the Pentagon was just using you as a vector to spread Fox Die. Fox Die? It can't be. Are you telling me Naoki was working with the Pentagon? They thought she was, but it seems that Dr. Naomi Hunter could be controlled so easily. What? We got a spy working in the Pentagon. He reported that Dr. Hunter altered Fox Guy's program just before the operation. But no one knows how or why. I wonder. Maybe they arrested us and we can find out the answer for that. No doubt. But I had no idea she was motivated by such petty revenge. We still Damn. don't know what changes she made to Fox Guy's program. Oh well, doesn't matter. I've already added the Fox Die vaccine to my list of White House demands. There's a vaccine. There must be, but that woman is the only one. Not that there know. must be. Yeah, shit, bro. I'll fuck you. Anyway, it might prove to be unnecessary. Why is that? You were successful in coming into contact with all of us, so we must have all been exposed to the virus. It's true that the Armstead President and Deep Grey Octopus were killed by Fox Die. But Ocelot, myself, and you, the carrier, were apparently unaffected. A bug in the virus's program. Hmm. Could be. In any case, if it doesn't kill you, then I'm not worried either. After all, our genetic code is identical. So it's true. You and I are... Yes, twins. 
Yeah, that's what I'll say. No, it's twins, but like, come on. He's so aggressive, he's like, he's just like, well, I'm not like you! We all can't be perfect, right? This is the second to last boss. And you saw me fight this fucking asshole a long time ago. He fucking sucks. Don't you take the uh the rocket? The lock on rocket? I forgot what it's called. The stinger, right? Yeah. Reminds me of machine drum. Metal Gear Rex. The third Metal Gear Actually, it kind of looks like Gundrum. Huh? 